Dear colleagues, good morning. How are you today? My name is Laszlo Tobar. Welcome to this very interesting course. The course places emphasis on how to find the breast cancer in its earliest phase. You have to understand that the early phase of breast cancer sometimes, many times, doesn't show a very characteristic stellate appearance. There will be very subtle changes, tiny calcifications, architectural distortions, and we must be able to find them. Or if we already found them, we must be able to demonstrate on the monitors. What is important in our course is that we teach the radiologist every single density and lucency on the mammogram by showing them three-dimensional thick slice histology. This gives them skills to tell the woman if she doesn't have the cancer that she has a normal mammogram. Well, first of all, you have to collect the data. You have to collect the cases the well-positioned cases, the beautiful mammograms, the difficult cases, so we have a good proportion between the easy to read and the difficult to read cases. Now, after you collect all these cases, you really have to put them out on the display. So we had to find those monitors and computers that could really give back the same quality as what we experience when we are sitting in front of the viewing stations. I'd like to thank those few companies that support the course. Barco Company shipped 50 monitors here and we set up these viewing stations. We have been very satisfied with the Barco. First of all, because it provides a very uniform and uniformly high quality. So we really tested their monitors because, as I mentioned to you, very subtle calcifications may be spread out in a whole lobe, and if it's not going to be presented with a uniformly high quality on every monitor, then the teaching is going to fail. I was very pleasantly surprised when I first experienced the clone view because the image came up very fast and it was very high quality. That was love at first sight. I just liked it. Oh, that was a very humbling, fantastic award. The first Alex Margulis Award for Scientific Excellence. We appreciate it a lot, not only because of my uh, research group's hard work for decades, but mostly because we hope that the issue is going to gain attention. It was a very nice gesture from the leadership of the RSNA.